Happy Halloween 2021. That's right, it is October 31st, which means it is my favorite holiday of the year, Halloween. So this is actually the first Halloween in this house because we moved out shortly after Halloween last year. Now, I really don't know how to start this uh, it, because obviously I like to do a whole thing on Halloween, right? So I, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you the process. We were going to do, and I was planning to just use the porch and hand out candy, stand in the front door, hand candy out the porch, you know, have people walk up. However, that poses an interesting problem. The pathway for our house, well, you, let me just show you. So unlike our old house, which had a giant porch in the front, this house basically just has this. You got a little porch here, and then you got a step here, step here, and then this walkway, which goes out to the driveway. So you can't really fit a ton of people here. Um, you know, you can walk through here, but this is not a huge pathway to the driveway, which is here. And my mom was like, this is too narrow for people to walk on. So instead, we are going to use the garage, which my father has already pulled his car out into the street. We're just going to set everything up in here. My mom's car can stay. And we're just going to do it in here. It's actually convenient, though, for the dry ice, which we'll talk about later, because if you remember, we can store it right there. So later on today, we're going to go and get some dry ice. Uh, I'm going to start probably doing a little bit of preparation now because I, I like to be early with preparation so nothing bad ever happens. Oh, I left the front door open. That's not good. So, yeah, I will show you some more preparations as they happen. First step here, and you can hear the washer draining. We're going to get some things. So from this room, we need this. This is the once a year uh, West Bend percolator that I basically use as a kettle to keep water warm. You could use a tea kettle, but a tea kettle will shut off after five minutes. This stays on for two hours. So we're going to need this. I don't know how old this is. I think it's like two years old, a year old. Okay. Next, we're going to go into, this is the Halloween bin. don't know how much shit of mine is in here. Apparently it's just shit because nothing. And then I naturally lose the bucket or the lid. Oh, you know what? That's because it would be in there. Uh, ooh. That's a nice sound. Well, we're fuckity, aren't we? Where did that shit get? You know what, let me put the camera down. I'm gonna look, just just give me a second. So the bulb is already in the garage, but I am stupid because my pitcher was literally sitting here, just like this. This is my Rubbermaid pitcher that I use to bring the water to the percolator. You can see I have a Sharpie line drawn on there from last year. Uh, which is basically, this is a giant ass pitcher, it's like, well, it's a gallon. That percolator is not a gallon. I probably could have bought a smaller pitcher, but I had to go, you know, balls to the wall saying, no, nope, no, nope, no, nope, biggest pitcher. I think there were bigger ones, though. But this is just an El Cheapo pitcher that I use once a year, because I literally have no other use for it. So those are the two things I need, let's go upstairs. Hey, Andrew G. What's in here? I don't know what that is. Nice noise, though. You can hear the washer through the wall. Anyway. Oh, I haven't shown this yet. Yep. So pretty. Anyway. Here I have some stuff. Got the percolator. Um, this. Need to go and get the black light. I need to remember that. It's upstairs. What does that say on it? Oh, store for Halloween. That's the store with Halloween. So in this bin, we have two uh, things we're going to need. This is a little, uh, it goes in the ground. It's a little, like, black light thing from Spencer's. And then I have the 
cheap, cheap, cheap Chinese party bulb from Party City. And what we're going to do is we are going to put that probably in this socket. Then we're going to unscrew slightly that bulb and these bulbs so that when you hit the switch over there, instead of getting just like normal, you know, daylight CFL light to light up the garage, probably put it in that one because we're going to be sitting here. You're going to get some pretty cool light. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to scoot this car back about five feet. I'm going to go up there and unscrew that and those two. And then we're going to put this party bulb in there. First bulb done. Sadly, that's as tall as my main tripod goes. So what we're gonna do, take the El Cheapo party bulb, which I should mention, for the record, this bulb is so Chinese that you can actually make it light up. It's very unsafe. I would not recommend running one of these like for a long period of time, but Come up here, take that down, put the Chinese bulb in, and then here's the bulb that was in there. It's a just a CFL, daylight CFL. I'm going to put this in the bin. I'm recording it so I remember to say it. It's in the bin. And then we're just going to do these two. So we'll time lapse that. test the party bulb. There's the ceiling. Let's hit the switch. Hey, it works. Of course, it's too light out to see anything now. But we got it to work. Good. All right, so that is the table that was in my basement that I had fans stored on, brought it out here. And then over here, I got my black, sorry about the angle, I have my camera on the tripod. My black light there, the computer speakers from my basement, old ass computer, extra surge protector, the percolator and stuff's over there. And then I got a cooler, which I didn't even know we had, that is gonna be used for the dry is. So that's gonna be another subject of another video. I'm gonna set the camera up, we're gonna set this stuff up. So naturally, the cord for this is in the basement, but that's what it does look like. Take this shit out, and then you got a thermos. This is all just extra stuff that would be used if it was a percolator. So I found the cord for the percolator. For some reason, it was sitting in my workshop on top of that blue Dominion box fan, like draped over the side of it. which. 
How it ended up there is beyond me, but I found it. Obviously, we can plug it in and give it a test. Well, uh, it's not working now, but it, it should. I need to test this. Just starting a tiny bit of the editing right now just to get some of the stuff done. Put all of the clips that we have now recorded into the editor and I'm editing the second one. Gonna go get the dry ice now and then probably edit the rest of them. There's not that many, so knock that out before it's trick-or-treating time. Okay, I just went and got some dry ice as well as some other groceries. I think I got about 10 pounds worth maybe. So, uh, yeah, I'd say that's pretty good. Um, went to Myers. I get mine from Myers. 24 bucks later, it was like two bucks a pound, so no, 239 a pound. So next up, it'll be trick or treating time. All right, folks. Well, um, you can see here have this is where the candy's gonna go. We're gonna sit here. We got the table. We it was up here somewhere. We moved it back. Um, just be more out of the way. Got my old S4 here. This has the playlist ready, and so we're gonna play that. Uh, I just did some editing, took about 20 songs off. Uh, former, uh, it's a YouTube user, former friend of mine, former acquaintance. Uh, we, or rather, he made a playlist that was thousands and thousands of songs long. I trimmed it down last year sometime to like 300 of the best, and then just now I took 20 more off that I decided, you know, fuck them. Nobody, nobody listens to, for example, an instrumental of just the two of us. So that came off. Um... I don't know where the hell this came from. Looks like it's coming from back there somewhere. I'm going to probably move this ladder and just set it up against the wall. Dry is. Hopefully it's not melting too badly. Nope, it's not. Still solid. Good, good, good. So we'll move that shit back. I'm going to use that to break. Ooh, I need a hammer. I need to remember that. Get a hammer. And, uh, yeah, we're down to the final, about 45 minutes. Starts at 6, and, uh, should be fun. Based on the request of my mother. Ooh, cool, cool. Too bad that it's only... Well, if you're back here, what can you see? Oh, that's, that's, that's cool enough, I think. Even though you can't see it back here. <laughs> um, based on my, the request from my mother, I screwed that ball back in because she wanted some, some light. But yeah, that's it for now. Of course, I have my Harvest Gathering Bath and Body Works hand soap in my bathroom too because this stuff actually ran out yesterday, ironically, and that smells great. Okay, so this is all stuff from my football team's homecoming uh, parade. There's so much noise at once. Basically, uh, I went to the homecoming parade. Let me pause, family guy. I went to the homecoming parade for my high school back on the 1st. And then I got all this candy. This is the bucket that was in my trunk that I collected it in. This is all shit I'm just now separating that I don't want. None of the Jolly Ranchers, none of that bullshit. This is all with the stuff that I'm going to keep. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, never mind. Okay, that's what I'm keeping. Wait. Yes. All right. Time to fill the pitcher up to about the two-quart line. thing takes quite a while. The two quarts is where I found the percolator sits. Okay, and now the all-important part, which is going to be the food coloring. Now, last year we did blue. So this year we could do green or, uh, well, what, what do we do? Green, red, or yellow? You know what? Since Joe Biden is the president now, I guess we're going to go green. So... Let me take the cap off. This is like gel food coloring. Uh, it's what I have. I bought it last year. Here we go. Ready? Get that nice and green in there. Nice green. I'm going to get it a little greener. There we go. That that should be green enough. We want the shit to be like dark mother effing green. All right. That looks good. 
We don't really need the lid, but let's go outside. Okay, take that off. And... It is hot water, so that should be good. To the top. Put that in. Come back here. And plug that in. Now if you come over here, there it goes. It's gonna start working. So yeah, and there's a plane. We live in a flight path. So there it is. You can see right here we have this. And that's gonna shine up on the house. I got the speakers and Halloweenus. Dry ice is back in the fridge, so yeah, should be fun. Turn this on. I have my uh, list from last year, so we'll peel this off. My Halloween tally. So we had 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65 exactly last year. So this is this year, and I think the next update is gonna be Halloween, got 10 minutes. One other thing, my mother made these bags with variety stuff that we bought at the store. We just made bags, and there's 130 bags, there's more. So basically, instead of counting, I'm probably just going to like tally up and see how many um, bags are left. That'll probably be easier, but we will see. I got a piece out. Let's break it. Now, take a piece or two. There we go. We'll do three. That'll be the first, first, uh, chooch, I guess you could say. All right. I don't know if the percolator's heated up yet, but we're going to do it anyway. Now that's nice. Look at that. That looks good. So that'll be the first one up, I guess. Forget about what we said about Joe Biden. We're doing green because MSU won. Never mind. We did blue last year, and I'm pretty sure MSU won then too. Okay, it's officially time. It's also raining, if you can tell. A little bit. Yeah, kind of. So, yeah. Start to get some people, hopefully. Just put that one in, it's about 6.15, got, oh, seven people so far, and yeah. Eight bags though, because one little kid took two, but can't read, so can't blame them. Cool, cool. <laughs> I had my eyes closed for that. Cool, cool. Cheesecake, bitch. And that's where we're at so far. Okay, so now it's just about a little after 6:45. Number of people so far, probably a good 40 almost, if not more. Dry ice. That's a nice group over there. That'll be nice. Quick, quick update. The light stopped working. I had to get the ladder and fix it. Dry ice. Mute uh, the shit. And it's almost 7 o'clock. Okay, I had a spill to attend to. But I cleaned it. We've already beaten last year. We're at 60... 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 60. We're at 68. I kind of lost track in the end there, but we both counted 9, so we're going with 68. So yeah. And it's 7, almost 7, 10. Well, block is pretty much empty. Ooh, is that someone? Why is the camera blinking blue? What's blinking? I don't know. Oh, it's on the camera. Nobody here for now. I'm gonna see if I can show this without getting the address in it. There's the pro, it's really hard to see on camera, but it looks really cool in person. Miss everything, including license plate. The plumpkin. Um, and yeah. 
Already at 68, still haven't got any more. We're at 715. It is chilly out, it's probably in the 40s. We got three more, but I was inside watching the Saints unfortunately beat the Buccaneers. Unfortunately, oh, 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 look, look at that. that. God damn it. That's a terrible way to end it if you're Tom Brady. Yeah, really. Watch it, watch, watch, Woo! watch, right watch. Arms. Then they can't, they just can't stop him. They tried, but they fucking failed, and that counts for shit. And the game, yeah. Not what I wanted to see. Fuck. Well, good way to end Halloween night. Give your gay buddy a chest rub. There's no way they can... No, because they need two scores. Yeah. And they just... Yeah. It's, it's over. Yeah. Damn it! That sucked. They need eight points. Yeah, really, and that's not going to happen. Ooh, we're out of focus. Okay, so it is oh uh, seven, eh, about seven forty-three, and so far we have eighty-one people beat sixty-five. That's for sure. That pitcher looks cool, and the China ball, which the camera would pitch a bitch trying to focus on, and I don't, I don't. Um, anyway. I'll see if I can do the show the purple now, now that it's like pitch black out. There you go. Bad look. That's the house. It's nice. And yeah, all the stuff in here. Probably going to head in about 15 minutes. I don't think much else is going to happen. So my mom, there's that. My mom was like, now is your chance. Put your clown costume on and go take the pumpkin. Go trick or treating. Now. No, 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 no. I'd rather be handing out candy. In my opinion, it's much more fun. Just a word of advice. And that's where we're at. And it is currently, ooh, it's a little after 7.50. It's 7.51. We're at an even, what are we at? I have 10. We're at an even 80. I was wrong before with 81. Okay, everyone. Well, the official time is just about to strike 8 o'clock. It's about 8.58. Okay, it is now officially 8 o'clock, or 8.59, very close. We are at, I believe, 85 total, even 85. Wouldn't that be cool? Two years where I get even numbers. I got 65 and then 85. I think it's about time we pack up. What do you think? Is that going to be? Yeah. Here, 10 minutes. I'm okay. All right. I should edit, edit these videos on my laptop out here. That would take forever, though. <laughs> and the dog's barking. Okay, that's creepy. Oh. Epic. All right. <sighs> Folks, we're going to call it a night. Um, I'm going to turn off the Smashing Pumpkins for now so I can talk. We have had 86 total. This is our 2021 total we had 65 last year um go ahead and unplug the percolator the speakers too we're gonna be done uh there's a black light you can close the garage again. no because i gotta get the light bulbs so yeah we're doing some tear down and uh pretty much gonna call it a night but i hope your guys halloween was good ours was it's about 45 out though it's not that warm and uh hopefully you have a good night and yeah, maybe you went trigger. Tell me about it in the comments. I don't know. You tell me. Thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe and click like if you like what you see. And follow me on the web, wix.com slash theelevatorworld slash fans. Bye-bye, and I hope you had a good Halloween.